the partnership between the nuclear industry and large energy users such as tech companies with AI data centers was another highlight from the 2025 World Nuclear Symposium. Why do technology companies need nuclear energy and is there evidence of business coordination between the tech sector and nuclear industry? Yeah, I thought the most interesting thing was that Microsoft is now a member of the World Nuclear Association and they were there um, at the conference. And I think that's really telling because a few years ago, nobody would have predicted that one of the world's largest technology companies would be involved in nuclear energy. And it's, it's really about their aspirations around AI data centers. Uh, as I mentioned, they, they do consume huge amounts of power. And I think they're realizing not just Microsoft, but Google and Meta uh, and the other companies that their aspirations in this AI race, and it is a race with China, um, it's not about chips or people or, you know, building these facilities. A lot of the challenges is sourcing clean, firm energy uh, that they can use to power these data centers. And that's why these uh, hyperscalers, as they're called, are, are really looking to nuclear energy to be part of the solution. They're still relying on, on renewable energy sources and other clean forms um, and natural gas um, as well. But nuclear is, is part of the solution that they've, they've realized in the last couple of years. And that's why these hyperscalers are bringing their capital, they're bringing their people into the, into the fold here. And it is kind of getting investors excited when some of the most valuable companies in the world are interested in this technology.